Hello, SEO Law students. This is another segment of SEO Law Tech Tips. My name is Ed Maniquil, and I'm with Law Technology. It's 2021, exams are coming up, and you need to install Exemplify. Let's teach you how to do it. Let's get started. For this video, the Exemplify install summary for Windows OS is verify your portal registration credentials. Go out to the portal registration and obtain the latest Exemplify install files. Download and install the Exemplify installer. Complete the registration of your local copy of Exemplify and learn how to download so you can run all the mock exams. Let's get started. Whether you're a first year law student admitted in the fall, a returning student or a transfer student, you'll get an email from Law Student Services containing your ExamSoft portal registration credentials. Within that email, it's going to detail that your portal registration user ID is going to be the 11-digit ID, which is the same thing as your student ID, and a password that's generated for you. Once you verify that you got that notification, then you can go out to ExamSoft and verify your credentials. So let's get started. You'll want to go out to www.examsoft.com, click on login, student slash exam taker, choose your institution or institution ID, which is SCU Law, select Santa Clara University School of Law, click continue, make sure you go to ExamSoft user portal. And now you're at the ExamSoft user portal, Santa Clara University School of Law. Here you can log in with your 11 digit student ID and the password that was given to you in that email sent to you by Law Student Services. Now that you've entered your 11 digit student ID and the initial password, let's log in. Now that you're at the ExamSoft portal registration console site, here, you can go to your account, and I would suggest that you reset your password, something that's more suitable to you, and then log out, and then test it again. Let's do that now. We've changed our password, logged out. Now let's log back in with our new password. Now you just verified that you can get into your ExamSoft portal registration with your new password. Great job. Now we can go ahead and download the latest Exemplify install file by clicking on download. At the time of this recording, the version that we are downloading for Windows 10 is Exemplify version 2.5. Once it's finished downloading, go out to the downloads area, run the Exemplify underscore 2.5.0 underscore win executable, Click next, accept the terms, click install. Click finish. If Exemplify doesn't run by itself, go ahead and click on Exemplify for the first time. It'll ask you to agree to the software license agreement. Go ahead and scroll down. Click on agree. Add a new account, which is the institution ID is again, SCU Law. And put in your 11 digit user ID, which is also your access ID. And then sign in. It's going to complete the registration of your local copy of Exemplify, and then you should see the Exemplify console. You'll notice there's a bunch of mock exams that you need to download. We suggest that you download all three of them and run all three of them. 
So in order to download, just select it, make sure the blue bar is next to the exam template to download and click on download. Some things to note before you run your mock exams, make sure that your name is up here, the 11 digit ID, and it says Santa Clara University School of Law. Also make note of the AG ID, which is anonymous grading ID that should already be pre-filled. And when you get ready to start, the exam password should be Bronco five. That's lowercase B-R-O-N-C-O -O number five. Now that you verify that your exemplifier is working correctly because you ran all three of the mock exams, a few days before your exam, you'll get a notification on downloading the templates for each of your exams. If you do, just run exemplify, refresh the exam list, and it will show up in this area. Click next to the exam template, download it on the day of your exam. Make sure to follow the instructions within the email that's sent to you with remote exams or in class that will provide instructions for you and the password in the classroom. For remote exams, the password will be given to you. For more information, go to our site, law.su.edu slash law tech, or go to our help desk site. It's lawhelpdesk.su.edu. Visit our YouTube channel at SU Law Techs or go out to our Instagram at SU Law Techs.